Hey guys, Piston Slap here, and today we are going to talk about Moto Vloggers support. Not so much uh, what we were talking about a few uh, weeks ago, where you know supporting your local Moto Vloggers, but more of the at home while you're editing uh, your girlfriend, your boyfriend, if you're a girl Moto Vlogger, um, things like that. So your 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 support that you have at home for moto vlogging does it even exist well from my point of view and really not my point of view but my situation is no i have zero support from the family side of moto vlogging be it my mother my father my siblings my wife my little one likes to watch but you know a three-year-old not really so much uh hey daddy do this or hey daddy try that um so some of the things I often wonder with that support would be uh, different techniques, uh, maybe placements of things, uh, stuff to talk about. You know, the subject content that we talk about as moto vloggers that might be appealing to different people. Sometimes having, you know, other people behind the scenes of a moto vlog could probably make it go from just your ordinary mode of vlog to something that was epic that a lot of people are going to be in tune to or you know maybe broaden your audience that's going to be watching your mode of vlog and have an idea of what you're talking about um, also putting together things so that they stay on point and on topic which is something I really struggle with Maybe I have a condition. I don't think so. It's just that there's so much in the world today and so many different ways to be pulled. It's hard to stay on topic with a certain thing. I don't know if you guys as a motive vlogger might have this problem. Some of you guys seem to be, you know, this is what we're going to talk about. And you really just real rounded on that topic. Um, me, as far as staying on topic with, you know, like today, we're talking about the support you know how many times I'm gonna go through this before I actually get something down that I like I don't script my moto vlogs I don't type out things I just kinda of jot down I'd like to talk about support for moto vlog and that is it I don't you know type out a whole you know itinerary I guess you'd call it or a script not an itinerary really we're not flying we're riding um, but I, I like to just kinda of off the top of my head this is how I see it and then I you know, play it back to see if it's really what I want you guys to hear or my topic that I had to talk about. Um, so that's one of the things with that support system is, you know, eventually as a person I do run out of ideas of what to talk about. So I'm always, you know, throughout the days at work writing down different things and stuff, you know, and I, I'm the only input to this that I have. I don't have the the other half of the family to support me as far as you know what's going on another thing is editing post editing um, I don't have anybody uh, there again in the family that watches my videos and goes oh well hey that was a really neat idea or you know where I'm at today writing in this video is hey I'd like to come up there visit and go up there and check that out I don't have any of that so all the stuff and places I go I literally just look on Google Maps go this is where I'm going today and that's where I end um, so that's about that uh, I don't know you know maybe some of you guys that are married or even have a significant other girlfriend boyfriend whatever it is um, might have an idea or something you could add to this as to what it's like to be on the other side of the fence having somebody you know critique you and help you out along the process it could be a good thing it could be a bad thing sometimes you know people tend to bring out the more bad things of your motive vlog instead of you know hey well look at this look at the glass is half full other than half empty I guess you would say so that's you know things that I think about you know some of the other motive vloggers I watch out there some of their contents really good sometimes I wonder you know is there is there someone else behind the scenes there that's helping them out along the way um, or are they really just coming up with this content all on their own and it's just like woohoo you know this guy's just super epic and awesome and or girl uh, there's a few female motive vloggers out there that I follow that are really have some good stuff 
Um, so that's about all the time I've got for this topic. I really didn't have a whole lot to put into it because it's really one of those, you know, side A, side B, and I've only got side A. Um, so I hope you guys are having a wonderful winter for you guys down there in the Southern Hemisphere. Enjoying your summer. Ride safe, my friends. I'm Piss and Slap. I'm out. goes all the way up and then it like comes to like a little campground out in the middle.